Good morning, everyone. The day has arrived. Um, today, five years ago, I went to the Chamber of Commerce and I registered uh, my company officially. And of course, I've already been uh, added. I, I, I've, I've added it for, for years on end for my friends, for my colleagues, uh, for my teachers even. Until someone told me, you know what? You're doing this stuff for free. You should really, really try to find a way to actually make money with it. Um, and that's what got the ball rolling. So uh, five years ago, on the 17th of March, it was a Monday, um, I went to the Chamber of Commerce and I officially registered um, as a company. And it's a great story, actually, um, that I was a little early. Um, the, the office is in the big city. I was a little early, so I walked into a department store and I ran into uh, this guy that I knew from the bar I worked at at the time. And I told him, because I was like sort of buzzing at things, so he was like, so what, 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 are, you, what are you doing here, what are you up to? So I was like, I'm on my way to the Chamber of Commerce, and the whole story came out. Um, and then he told me, so, oh, okay, well, in this company I work for, we have this, edit, this pool of editors, so I can, I can, you know, I can, you know, maybe put your name down or whatever. I was like, oh, that would be great. And I didn't hear from him for like another two years ago, another two years or so. Until I think, yeah, I think that, yeah, it was about three years ago. Um, he, like, I, three years ago, I wasn't sure. Um, I was having, I, I was also teaching, I was teaching a lot of the time. I didn't have that many clients. I was still only focusing on academic editing. And I was not entirely sure whether I should just give up the company or I do like a restart. And I did, like, I, I did a whole new website with my friend. Uh, branched out and this is when this guy returned to me and now um, he and, and his company works for one of my biggest clients um, so it's nice it's, it's nice to see how that I still love that story like he was the first person I told um, who was not in my like you know in my in my in crowd um, that I was uh, going to do this um, and yeah, when I finally said to myself three years ago, this is it, like, I'm, I'm, I'm trying, I'm going to find a way out of all the day jobs that I had uh, to keep this business going, and I'm really going to do it, I'm really going for it, and that is when he returned to me and became um, one of my biggest clients, and the, the company he works for as well, like, they hire me for all kinds of, of stuff. So. so that's sort of my, sort of my, you know, uh, beginning story. Um, so this day, um, I have... I'll be uh, online every uh, every hour for the next 13 hours. So this day is going to be a bit crazy for me. I don't even want to know what I look like uh, by the end of this day. Uh, but before I start the first giveaway, I wanted to express, I think that's a very good sentiment to start the day with. I want to express my gratitude uh, for the people who um, always believed in me, who stuck with me. So I was just making a list earlier, and of course there were plenty of people like the same with writing a novel. It takes a, I always say it takes a village to write a novel, and you know, it takes a village to, to raise a child. I would say for me, like it took a village to get me where I am, um, and I'm grateful for all the members uh, of them. So I was thinking, um, I remember when I first started the website, my friend Martina, very, very, very brilliant photographer. Um, she helped me out with building the website, and she made the pictures that I still use um, as, or, or, as, on my profile. There's Michelle. Michelle was the person um, who, when I was about to jump ship, told me, no, no, you're really good at this. You should do this. You should branch out as well. So that's the, she was the one who made me, um, who made me, who uh, gave me the confidence to um, not just do academic writing, but also go into nonfiction and fiction. And she helped me with my new website. And she was, she's been a huge support ever since. Um, so I'm, I'm, I'm just really grateful for her friendship. There's Sheena, Sheena Mary, um, who I mention a lot. Um, there's nothing in particular I'm grateful for. Like, she's just always, she believes that I can do whatever I want to do. She's always there for me. She's always, like, she lets me vent. Um, she's there when I need to pick me up. She's just my, my, uh, she's, like, I have, that's the thing. I have no words for what I have with her. Like, she's my, uh, she just keeps me going. So I'm really grateful. And I'm also really grateful, she'll be on later uh, today as well, she does a giveaway with us today. So I'm really grateful that you get to meet her as well. Um, so you finally have a face <laughs> to go with the person I always talk about. There's Kelly. Um, 
telling my business coach, uh, oh, she's made me see through so much of my own bullshit, and she really pushed me out of my comfort zone. And I wouldn't be here uh, today if it, if it weren't for the sessions I had with her uh, last summer. Um, she made me grow so exponentially. I'm so grateful for her. Then, of course, um, there's John. John will be... John will be on with us in ten hours, uh, in twelve hours, uh, in in twelve hours. Uh, he's the latest guest today, and for some reason, John saw some potential in me like over a year ago, um, and he started asking me like, um, "Would you be interested in becoming an apprentice with my company?" He has his own editing company as well, so he actually took me under his wing and and, and taught me the art of ghostwriting, copywriting, um, and that has been an amazing experience, and it broadened my horizon in such a way. I don't even know where to begin uh, to thank him. So I'm really glad he'll be on as well. So you get, well, of course, like if you've seen my, my heart to heart recently, this is the John, John Robin I'm talking about. Um, I'm so grateful that uh, he, he's in my life. And actually, I met him through Sheena. So there's the connection already. Um, it's interesting to see how in that, like we, 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 the, the people that you connect to, um, how they will bring you to the right other, to the right people. Like if you, once you make a good connection, they will get you to the not, to the other uh, person uh, who will make such an influence uh, or have such an influence on your life. So the last person I want to thank is Ashley, and Ashley will be on with us today as well. Um, my six p.m. is four p.m. GMT. Um, look at <laughs> look at the schedule. Uh, Ashley Shannon, she's my uh, virtual assistant, and she'll be giving away newsletter packages. And if it wasn't for Ashley, um, I don't know, same with Kelly, if it wasn't for Ashley, I wouldn't be here today. I would still um, try to hide in my own shadows, uh, not show my face here. Um, I don't know, there's just, she made such an impact. Uh, she made such an impact on my life and I'm really glad uh, that you'll get to meet her as well because she's an amazing VA um, and you know one of the things I'll be doing today is launch my new writing program my new year uh, this is like a year-long writing program it's called 52 weeks of writing and without Ashley um, it wouldn't be here like just very simple like it wouldn't be here like I wouldn't have done it I wouldn't have gotten like I wouldn't have I wouldn't have the guts to do it um, she's very uh, technological savvy so she set the whole thing up it's it's so grateful that, that she's in my life. Uh, so I'm really glad you get to meet her as well. Um, so stay tuned if you want to know, get to know these people uh, and maybe also uh, want to hire them uh, because they're amazing individuals who are so good at what they do. So just... So, ha, the gratitude is out of my system. Oh, it's not out of my system, but you know what I mean. Like, got it off my chest. Um, so basically, this is what today is about for me. Um, this giveaway, um, this I have multiple discounts also by these people, which is just, I was gonna do this all by myself, and then John was the first to say, you know, can I, can I help out in any way? And I was like, you know what? I've been on the fence about asking friends um, to, to you know, um, help me out and do something fun. But then once I said yes to John, the next person came, the next person came along, and now I'm, I'll be sitting here for 13 hours talking to you, um, sometimes with them. So that's been crazy. So another reason why I'm so grateful um, that to have these people in my life. So for me, this day is about giving back to the community um, because I've been so supported in this journey um, and I just want to give some of that support. I want to try to give some of that back uh, today. So hopefully um, you'll get that, you'll, 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 you'll get that feeling. Or that I'll at least like I'll, I'll succeed in giving something away. So let's do that. Let's let's give away something. I don't have the um, the paperback copy of the book is still in the Netherlands, so I'll show it to you. I also have the ebook. Um, so this is okay. So for today, very simple rules, and I'll pro I'll try to repeat them in every video. Um, I know a lot of giveaways are very centered. Like you can only enter this giveaway if you're in the U.S. or in the U.K. Or whatever. My giveaways are worldwide. Um, you can, I still have my throat issue going on. You can uh, enter until the 24th. I will draw winners on the 25th. So, um, not this Monday, but next Monday. 
And um, once I draw the winner, I will email them and ask them, do you want an ebook or do you want a hard copy? I'm not kidding. Um, I'll send it to you, but I don't care where you are. Um, I'll send it to you. If you, want a paper, if you want a paperback, I will get you the paperback. If you're uh, an e-reader person, I will give you the, the e-book. It's fine. Um, so it doesn't matter where you are. Uh, just assuming that Amazon will send it to you, of course, like that. We'll, but we'll figure something out. It'll be fine. So, okay, first book uh, that has a tremendous impact. So that's the thing what I'm going to do today is I'm going to give away the books that are meaningful to me. So I'm sharing with you the material that made me grow as a writer. Um, so these are all books that I love. Um, so first I'll share, like, I don't even know if it's going to show you right. Um, the Successful Author Mindset by Joanna Penn. If you don't listen uh, to the Creative Pen podcast, do, because it's, she is such a generous, generous soul. She shares so much information. She interviews like the most brilliant of people um, every week. And she also writes tremendously useful books. And this, uh, like I have all her books. This one, uh, of course, like people who know me know I always talk about the author mindset. It's more about the psychological aspect for me. Um, in my coaching, like not in my editing, of course, but in my coaching, it's very much about what blocks you, what keeps you from doing what you do, um, why aren't you writing what you're supposed to be writing, why aren't you writing what you want to write, what's keeping you, what's keeping you uh, from, from, from following your dreams. This book is perfect for that. It's, um, it's, not, it's not a big book, like, it's like, I don't, as I, like I said, I don't have the copy. It's, it's very small, but it's very to the point, um, it's very clear, it's very concise. Um, Joanna Penn doesn't beat around the bush. That's, uh, that's basically the summary uh, of this book for me. I once wrote a, a review on, on it as well, and I could link it. I'll, I'll link it in the comments. And so she talks about different things. It's very much about the mental aspect. So, you know, fear of failure, comparisonitis, um, what if I'm not original? She tackles all these fears one by one. Uh, she adds like beautiful writing quotes um, uh, to, her, to her chapters. And she actually doesn't just talk about the writing of the book. So, okay, what about what are the things that we struggle with while we're writing the book? But she also talks about mindset. You know, when you get the book uh, out, so when you get ready to get it published, because um, there are once the book is out there, there will be different fears, different obstacles. So she talks about those as well. And then also um, she gives like a list of, of tips like how to have that successful author mindset. So how to keep yourself uh, focused, happy, um, in love with what you're doing. So it's a great, it, it's absolutely, um, it's absolutely a great book. Like I said, it's very, it's, it's, it's not, it's not a big book. Um, I read it, I read it a few years ago when I was in Dublin. Yeah, it took, it took me a few hours. It's not, it's not that big, but it's, it's, it's so good. It's so good. Just the way how she, she handles, um, just the way she, she goes about it. Like what she does, I'm, I'm looking at it now. She talks about, for instance, here's fear of failure. So she talks about, you know, what is fear of failure? What does it feel like? And then she gives like an antidote. So she'll give you uh, tips on how to like switch, like switch that mindset. Like how do you get out of it? Uh, and I think that is just pure gold. Um, so this is the first book I'm giving away. Like I said, there will be many books uh, and many other uh, um, services I give away today. So what you do, if you wanna, uh, if you wanna have this book, you go to the uh, link that I posted um, in the description, and there you will see the whole giveaway. So if you already know what you want, feel free to click uh, whatever you want and just uh, submit. Um, but you can start doing that. Uh, you can start doing that now. You can also wait until the end of the day until you've seen all the videos and know exactly uh, what it is that you want. Um, but that's it. This, like, I really, if you, even if you don't get this book, um, do do get like do um, do read it because it's it's really it's 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 just profound. Um, so yeah, I will see you. I'm looking at the clock. I will see you all in 45 minutes. Um, to those who are awake yet, like I know <laughs> some of my clients are still asleep, they're a bit bummed, and I was like, yeah, those have clients in Asia and Australia, so, you know, you have to, you have to find the balance there. It's the thing about, like, I love working with people across the world, but the time zones are just uh, a challenge. Okay, I'll see you in 45 minutes. Um, follow the link if you want to get your hands on this book. Um, see you in a bit.